think disobedience for me is to disrupt something. For me, it's all playing with this idea that you're not going with the grain. And it's sort of like how we can change the way we see ourselves in clothing and change the way that we portray ourselves in sculpture. One thing Jonathan decided from the very start was that he didn't just want it to be a conversation between art and fashion, but also to bring in design, furniture, craft, and really just kind of open up these distinctions which often keep these things separate um, to see what happens when they're sort of brought together in the same room. So he was really interested in, particularly in the early works of Hepworth and Moore, which are really key to the displays here at the gallery. And Jonathan started to look at these things, and he actually at one point called them disobedient bodies. The fact that these things are figurative, but they're slipping into abstract, they're sort of barely readable, um, but somehow they always retain their form. Uh, and from that, he took that as a starting point to think about how artists and fashion designers have really reinterpreted and reimagined the human figure over the course of the 20th and 21st centuries. And one of the rooms that we have has uh, jumpers that are made that have been drawn from his collection and then exaggerated, so they hang from the ceiling. And the idea really is that people can play with those. They can tie them up, they can get inside them. The knit is really big, so you'll be able to see through them. And I think that, again, is another kind of thing of just being able to be in the gallery and behave in quite a different way to you, the way that you generally do. I think it, for me it was just sort of like when you start to do uh, a project like this, it is very similar to doing a fashion show because ultimately what you're doing is you're taking a whole load of information and you're trying to condense it into a message. When you come in you see these images and then you have this kind of raw format and to encourage people to kind of create their own self as a kind of fashion sculptural form.